Hello and welcome to the Savvy Gadgets channel with me, Ian, otherwise known as Ben. And first I'd like to say thank you to all those people who have subscribed to my channel recently and for the kind comments on my content. If you haven't already subscribed to my YouTube channel, then hit the subscribe button. And if you follow us on Facebook and Twitter where I post other bits and pieces, and if you want to support my channel further, head over to Patreon and donate. And don't forget... I do live streams 1 o'clock in the afternoon on a Sunday. I am currently streaming uh, Cyberpunk 2077, so don't forget to join me there, Twitch and YouTube. Today I'm looking for manufacturing instructions so that I can upgrade my weapons. Now they're also used to upgrade suits, so let's get on with it. Okay, so there was an update this morning, and up until recently these missions have been a bit sort of ruined. That's not the case now. This mission, I'm here to kill the members of the settlement. Previously, it was billed as a exterminate uh, scavengers, but there are no scavengers here. And if you did actually start attacking these people, you ended up with a bounty on your head. And that's wrong. Now, these guys... They're not against you until you actually start opening fire on them. So the best thing that I've found to do is to actually sort of get to the industrial building Wait, at the Commander. top back. This won't take long. Just no, a quick scan. scan All finished. No bounties. Jolly good. So I could, if I was just looking for manufacturing instructions, just clone an identity and then go to the data ports in the industrial buildings and go from there. One of the other options I've got, and this one's quite cheeky, is to take the power regulator, that means all of the guards will be alert, but that will have the, the advantage of turning off the sentry turrets, so they won't be able to shoot at me. Don't get many new faces now I do need a decent and then once I've got the power regulator I can go around all of the buildings and evacuate all of the oxygen killing all of the inhabitants so that's a couple of cheeky ways you could do it and so in order to evacuate the gas once you've got they've got no power you just open up this access panel here with the cutter and then you get the option to evacuate the gas. Now, if you if you're not on a mission to do that, generally you don't get the option, but uh, it can be done. So, <clears throat> what I first need is a level one security to get in here. Right, okay, so that's Andy. There's a medical case. That was a container with some stuff in it that I can just open. Yep, there's some goodies that I can take that I can swap for tungsten carbide weapon components. Bits and bobs. Some ammunition. Very, very handy. Trying to make trouble. No, I'm not trying to make trouble. Well, I will be in a minute. You wait till I open fire on you. Uh, there's another container. And, oh, look, an electrical cell case. That's going to be handy. Plus, whilst the base has got power, uh, I've got the option to... Uh, Recharge, of course. Uh, dominate a suit on, because I've now got access to a rocket launcher and my machine gun. And that would be really useful, and provided I can... Guys are actually beneath me. I 
usually in that crevice, although inside. But uh, I'll clear these guys out. Look, you can see them there. Look, there's one. The worker, he doesn't have shields. But the great thing is, his rocket launcher, as soon as they drop their shields, he just fire a rocket at them. Gone. And because I've got access to ammunition down the front, and the anti personnel turret is always facing up that way, I'm behind the turret, it can't shoot me. So very useful. So let's see. Now the rocket launcher is is effective. Okay, so this guy down here, he's got shield, two rockets, and he's gone. This is my second run as since the last one. Still nothing there. It really is hit and miss whether you get these manufacturing instructions or not. Aha! Uh -huh, finally! It's got one more data port to check out. Still got a few people to uh, take care of. I think we've taken care of all the guards. And uh, it's just one more place to go, so that means if I get one more, then I can upgrade my weapons. And to continue in the vein of getting the right stuff, I've actually found some compression liquefied gas. Which I need to do a uh, upgrade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I know, I guess I don't need that, but I'm looking around for other goodies that I can take. That's the second one of those I've found ever. Uh, I've got to be careful. Let's see if, I... Let's see if there's any going here. I actually need three. Oh. Excellent. Three. I've now got the three. I've now got enough compression and liquefied gas to upgrade a weapon. Okay, so before I leave this base now, I've taken care of everybody. I've taken all the bits and bobs that I want. Uh, I'm going to take the power regulator as well. And, uh... Because I'm going to need one at some point. So I'm going to take all of that. Two, and when this shuts down... I have already shut down the turrets at the command centre. This takes a few minutes. As you can see, it's very slow, but once this is gone, it's kind of the inverse of putting the regulator in. Um, this pops out and then you can take it. So. Now mine. <laughs> so the question is, doors got no power to get out. Of course, you use your power device. 
So, job done. And away we go. Well, it has to say, be said that that's not what I expected to find in there. Now, to be fair, I did just uh, use a rocket launcher on her, and that's where she ended up. Look. Nicely compacted away. <laughs> ah. She sort of like gibbered into it. Unexpected, but funny all the same. Oh my god! Finally! I found the third one! Oh my god! This is my sixth attempt! Oh, that's amazing. Finally, I can upgrade a weapon. Right, we're finally there. We've finally got all the components we need to upgrade the kinetic weapons. If you want to upgrade, if you brought the other style of weapons, the energy weapons, uh, and they are better at taking out shields, then um, you will need different components. Uh, so Something let's have a look. Your eye. Let me know. Sure. So Take if we upgrade on. or sell weapons. Now all of the kinetic weapons use exactly the same uh, components. Uh, this is the one I'm going to upgrade because I tend to use it the most. Now I did consider using upgrading this, but it's plenty good enough as it is for me to get more manufacturing instructions and more components. So and with an upgraded AR-50, I think that's uh, pretty good. But if you have a look at the energy weapon equivalent, it actually uses ionised gas instead of um, compression liquefied gas. And it also uses micro-electrodes and optical fibre. And uh, it's the same for the other weapons as well. So the same ionised gas. So what we're going to do is going to upgrade this weapon because uh, I've actually got everything. Upgrade unavailable. And yes, that's kind of where I've got to. I am officially stuck. There is a problem with upgrading weapons. Even though I have all of the components that I need, some of them are nicked. And if you get them out of your inventory from like your ship, and you try and transfer them into your backpack, they actually come across as saying they're stolen. And that might be the problem I'm facing. Other people have said they've got legit stuff, uh, legit components across the board, and they still can't upgrade their weapons. So uh, it looks like it's a thing at the moment, which is really annoying. However, thing there was a patch the other day, I mean, it is a couple of days later since I, 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 I tried to upgrade my weapons to, to start off with. Um, and you can now, if we take a look at the, because uh, I'm back at Hopkins City, if we look at the mission boards, just the other day, they started adding in, and if you look at that, you can now get weapon schematics from the, as rewards from missions. Yet, and this is the, the next big but, is all of these missions that I've tried so far to try and get any of these because I was I came across one that said compression liquefied gas so I thought great okay so tungsten carbide let's see if we can find one uh, it was one of these tungsten carbide I love the tungsten carbide don't I power regulators so that wasn't there the other day so uh, the th things are getting chemical catalysts so you can pick and choose missions depending on what you want to get I suppose to a larger degree but what I was hoping to do is get some legit, because uh, it's my the compression liquefied gas that for me is stolen or marked as stolen. So I felt there was a mission there was straight away, and so far I have been able to complete any of them. So damned if you do and damned if you don't at the moment. So hopefully things will only improve with patches as they're released. But until then, I'm stuck with the base weapons. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed my misery <laughs> in this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook and keep up to date with us on Twitter. And if you really feel like it, head over to Patreon and donate to my channel. But until the next time, thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.